Call now for a very special offer on a very stupid product. Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Everybody's got those days where they drink a 6 p.m. espresso and then binge a season of Bojack. Now it's 3 a.m. and their mind is racing because they said you too when that cute ticket taker said enjoy your movie yesterday. <laughs> and the best way to combat late night restlessness is with some trashy paid programming. That's right. But what is the worst of the worst when it comes to as seen on TV ads? The mythical team has trudged through the annals of time to Ooh. uncover the most ridiculous as seen on TV products, and we're gonna decide which one's the dumbest. It's time for Rank Worst As Seen on TV Products. Mythical team members Stevie, Christine, Jordan and Emily are going to be presenting as seen on TV products along with the ads that they come with. Yeah, they're gonna make their argument and then we're going to rank them and award the worst as seen on TV product of all time. All right, Jordan, why don't you go first? Uh, so I've got the Wax Vac, which is a space blaster for earwax. We all know we shouldn't use cotton swabs to clean or dry our ears. Wax Vac is quiet, listen. See how gently it vacs water and dirt, leaving your ears clean and dry. You just empty it out when you're done. Stop using other ear cleaners that don't work and stop using cotton swabs that can damage your ears. Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Such a great piece of infomercial overacting. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Ooh, ooh. I have to drain this pasta. Ooh, my house is on fire. <laughs> it's like, all right. Uh, yes, this is from the folks at Hampton Direct. Uh, it pulls dirt particles and moisture out of the ear with gentle suction. Uh, it's cordless, costs $9.99. So it shoves water in and then sucks it out? Does it take water out? It puts water oh, in no. and it then takes it out? Oh no, it takes water out. No, it doesn't put water, it gently draws the, yeah. moisture and debris. The okay, water I was I was confused, I was like, there's not a tank on it. Should we put water in though? No, you you actually have a little There's mo There's moisture in there. Ew. You have a, there's a little, oh, there was a little black piece that went right in there. What? Oh. what? Yeah, you had a little black piece. Oh, push oh. harder. Ow! Deeper, <laughs> deeper, deeper, deeper. That's as deep as it goes, man. Push it, man, push it. Should we leave? This makes me feel very, <laughs> very uncomfortable. That's as far as it goes. I like this one. It feels good, you try it. No, I'm not using oh, that. No, 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 clean it. I need my own wax vac. Wait, I wanna see what is in. Okay, let's see if it got anything. Is there like a tank? Yeah, yeah, you have to empty it over a sink. Didn't you see? Did. Jordan, did you try this? Uh, not on my ear, but I can confirm that it feels great on the human nipple. <laughs> <laughs> did you wash it after? Oh, look, look, look. No. That's the black thing that was in your ear. Look at it. What is that black thing? I don't yeah. know. There was a black thing. Oh, man. I think, uh, <laughs> well, th to me, this is the great product. So why is this yeah. bad? I mean, it feels great, it sucks hard, we're good to go, right? <laughs> sure, yeah. Maybe this is a great product. It's great, so I'm putting this, I don't wanna put it at four, but maybe I'm just weird. Yeah, well, that is affirmative. <laughs> All right, next up is Stevie. How about an egg scrambler for you? How about it? Do you scramble eggs like this? You never get a perfectly blended egg, and then there's the cleanup. But now there's the egg scrambler. It scrambles an egg while it's still in the shell. The egg scrambler perfectly blends the egg white and yolk in only five seconds. Uh, what? Okay. It sounds true. amazing. Um, so, this is the egg scrambler from the 1970s from uh, Ronco. Ron Popeil. Oh. And uh, it's a little vibrating needle that pierces the eggshell, scrambles the egg inside. Uh, in the 70s, it was $7.77. We paid $50 oh, for it cool. on eBay. Um, you know what's weird though is that I remember a commercial from when I was young, like in the late 80s, and like from what I remember, you're like going, like the camera's pushing down a hallway and there's a closed door and you hear like a vibration sound and then you cut back to a close up of this husband and he's like, honey? And then like you keep going towards the door and she's like, oh yeah! And then he opens the door and then she's there with her egg scrambler and he and she's just like, it's my egg scrambler. And he's like, doom, and he looks at the camera. Doom. Yeah. Are you sure you didn't just dream that? Yeah, no, I made all that up, but it would have been a better commercial. Let's than try what it. We saw. Wait, so she's using the egg scrambler in her bedroom? Yes, Very she is. Sensual ass. <laughs> she bought it as okay. a cover up. No, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it, guys. I'm, just I'm gonna eggs. try it. Okay. So I know that you, you pierced the egg first, 
Oh gosh. You I would. I would oh. Oh. It's on there. It's on there, and then you press down. Oh man. My question is not whether this works, it's why. I feel like you could use this as an earwax remover as well. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. All right. Put the needle in yeah. there. All right. Yeah. Mo moment of truth. <laughs> We're going to see if it actually scrambled. Well, I think it does scramble. But... And hold on, but that felt good. I will say that. As the only person who was touching <laughs> it while it was happening, it felt good. Ooh. Whoa! discontinuing it because people started sharing needles. <laughs> <laughs> now, I, I just don't know why. I mean, well, here's what I'll say. It's pretty cool, it's but like it's actually more trouble than just putting a bunch mm -hmm. of eggs into a bowl and scrambling them. Yeah. Yeah. Cleaning yeah. up eggs is like kind of one of the easiest things. They can yeah. come right off with water. Yeah. That is a very consistent scramble. Oh, okay. oh, they got you with the consistency, <laughs> huh? Yeah, like scrambling an egg is like the first thing you learn how to do when you're like learning how to yeah. cook. Yeah, I feel yeah. like if it's like if you had a machine in your house that was just for top ramen, it's like you don't need that. Need that. Yeah, absolutely. Right, right, right. It could make a good candy bowl though, and like when someone reaches in, they're like, <laughs> they're like well, <laughs> It could make a good torture device. You put your eye on it. Yeah. Oh. Now I'm putting this at two. What do you think? Yeah, I really don't need help scrambling my eggs, and I'm more than a little bit afraid of that needle. So. Yes, it is a worse product. <laughs> Next up, we got Christine. Hey. Uh, so this is Wonder Arms, a total arm workout system. Okay. Listen up, ladies. Are your arms and shoulders saggy, flabby, and out of shape? Isn't that the one area you could never find a solution for? This right here, it ain't sexy. That is my chicken wing. And this is the fat. A little schnitzel right here? That's what I'm not a big fan of. Introducing Wonder Arms, the breakthrough fitness sensation that all women are talking about. <laughs> all women, All huh? women. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, they're like, listen up, ladies, and we're all like, uh-huh, <laughs> I'm listening. What was the audition um, process for that commercial? You just <laughs> stepped in the room like, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> like a lot of double waving. Um, <laughs> I don't know, I feel like this product, the action that you achieve and the muscles that it work could be done with anything, like reaching for things, right? It doesn't... Well, Link, you tell me, are you <laughs> feeling your triceps? Um... A little bit, Your I am. Your bicep is. It looks like a uh, replica, like, Legolas Lord of the Rings bow that I got at Comic Con. Yeah. Ooh, oh, oh, my goodness. No. Wow. Dangerous. Uh, look at no. that. So that. That's not advised. That's exciting. <laughs> well, you're supposed to feel your triceps, your biceps, your shoulders, your chest, your back, and more. Do you feel more? Um, I feel a little pain where it hit me in the wrist. <laughs> Did you let go of that on purpose? Yeah, I was doing the Legolas. It was oh. a good idea, yeah, it seemed thank like. You. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a beginner, an intermediate, and an advanced band. You're currently on the intermediate band. Let me see if I can get a burn going while you try to convince me this is, oh, good. It's dangerous. Once yeah, get... I feel like you could just row a boat can instead. Ask, right? Did that woman Who's got a call? boat? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the simpler version of this. You just buy a boat. Simply buy a boat. Just buy a boat. <laughs> just a boat. Did that call that her arm a, a schnitzel? A schnitzel. <laughs> schnitzel. schnitzel. I don't but know. But a schnitzel is like a thin piece of so fried chicken. chicken. I can yeah, see. that's what it looked like. <laughs> like so She's very, very schnitzel. specific in her body dysmorphia. That's like very. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you <definitely> got <laughs> It's like, what does it look like? It's <laughs> 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 so much shame. Yeah. <laughs> For I, there's, I think there's some fellas who date ladies out there who like a thick arm. I like it, you know. You, you like a thick like arm, Jordan? You like a little schnitzel. Yeah. Yeah. I, like a little, I like a little schnitzel for lunch. <laughs> a little chicken wing. Add a little, add a little sauerkraut. <laughs> <laughs> all right. my schnitzel. Think of all the other words they used before they landed on schnitzel. Yeah. <laughs> the fact is, there are many ways to tone your arms. Can I get don't, your head in there? Don't involve, like, Potentially injuring yourself with like shards of plastic. And this isn't replicating this is any, any particular. You could go to a gym and go to every machine, and this would not be an exercise. <laughs> that you well, that's an, that's that's right. an argument for this being. Hey, really? we're, we're filling the white space in the arm exercise market. Yeah. So you think it's good? Uh, I am getting a little. I'm, my, I'm, my, chi, my triceps. <laughs> I found new muscles. That's what more is. Yeah. It's your chai set. That's the muscle you uh, work out when you uh, take your chai tea yeah. from Starbucks. So you're yeah. saying this is good, and I felt a little burn. I'm saying that if you did this and nothing else, 
I mean, you might get swole, <laughs> but I think you got to do it more than minutes a day. We're talking hours. But you could just use the resistant band without the actual machine and get the same result, right? Uh, I don't Can know, you, Christine. <laughs> <laughs> no, nothing, Christine. <laughs> nothing does, at all. Does it feel the same? It's at number four. But Ooh. I think we can all agree that sometimes a schnitzel arm is beautiful. Well, yeah. Yes. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Especially on a single mother. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> and a first responder. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Emily, what do we have? Oh boy, uh, it's Rejuvenique. Uh, it's an electric mask you willingly put on your face to fix your stupid face. In essence, Rejuvenique does for the face what exercise does for the body. And the way it does that is there's a control unit that during a facial session actually sends an impulse up to the zones in the mask and actually activates the face and skin to exercise, tighten, and tone. These impulses start in the forehead facial zone and about every 20 seconds automatically move one zone at a time through each of the 12 facial zones. Oh my. Okay, Emily, tell us more. Ah! <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> sure. Wow. Yeah. You really uh, make yourself look beautiful for the purge. <laughs> right. Oh, right. I will say this, I couldn't fit any Farva beans or Chianti in this tiny mouth hole. Zero stars! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take, the, it smells like a bitter divorce in here. Oh, gosh. Gotta, <laughs> <laughs> I'll take here you it. go, guys. Woo! All right, so that commercial is actually from 1999. What? Wow. Yeah. First of all, show them the inside of this. Look at that. It's just a bunch of thumbtacks. What is my, is my face look like Hellraiser just like made out with me or what happened? Like <laughs> just a, imprinted? No, you look all right. Give us more info here. All right, cool. So um, oh. it's got, it delivers nine volt electronic impulse, gold plated <sighs> facial cushions, uh, electrocuting <laughs> your face, supposed to like, Revitalize and work out your facial it's got muscles. Got a phone with it. <laughs> yeah, you could. Can you hear me? I'm yes. About, I'm about to turn this thing off. Oh, it hurts. It like, does. The a one's bit. right into your eyebrows. Beauty oh. is pain. Okay. <laughs> so there, there is a pulsation control oh. that goes from on to ten, and then I'm going to press start. So I'm turning it on. Oh, I heard a noise. And I'm going to press start. Oh no. And that's oh, on boy. two. Going to four. Going to six. Oh, no, good. You, you feel anything? You, you, hold on, turn it. You just slowly go to eight. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> eight. You look like the phantom of the soccer moms. All right. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Do I mean, I'm choosing something? to believe that you're faking, but it's uh, on 10. I'm not feeling anything except a little embarrassment. <laughs> you know, if it doesn't work, you could at least use it for like what to do with your face when people talk about matcha or sports. <laughs> That's what I want it for. Just put it on. I've got to do my treatment like, uh -huh. now. Tell me more about Bitcoin. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <It's the crystals. laughs> I'm not feeling anything. Okay. You're not feeling You're anything. You're into crystals just, now. It, cool. I don't hear it. Those spiky things just hurt, man. But there, there, there's no, there's no electricity, and even if there is, it's nine volts. I mean, wh what is that doing? It's not doing anything. It's not rejuvenating anything. Linda Evans. <laughs> it just looks creepy. But Linda Evans is doing something right. She's a beautiful woman, a beautiful older gal. Well, I think yeah. this might be a mask. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, it so. It looks very mask-like. At this point, let's decide, because the number one slot is open. Is this worthy of the worst as seen on TV product? Well, it doesn't work. I think it would scare your family. Uh, yeah, in, in my mind, the Rejuvenique yeah. is the most useless, worst as seen on TV product that we have seen today. It is ugly, it is stupid, it's scary. But it if you want to attract Jason Voorhees, I think this is a hot commodity. <laughs> there you have it, Linda Evans. You've sponsored the worst <laughs> product as seen on television. There, the definitive list. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You guys say you know what time it is. You, you know, know what time, time it is. is. I'm Dave. And I'm Megan. From Sumner, Washington, and, and it's, it's time, time to, to spin, spin the, the wheel, wheel of mythicality. mythicality. All right, click the top link and watch us match the team member with the dumbest products they've ever bought in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the Wheel of Mythicality is gonna land. Keep your friends close and your phone closer with the Mythical and GMM Pop Sockets, available now at mythical.store.